welcome back to yours truly DKC it's me yet again filming another amazing video on the beautiful island of Tobago now if you don't know Tobago is one island that is part of the country called Trinidad and Tobago and if it's your first time to this YouTube channel you need to know that this channel is about Tobago life in Tobago and the travels and adventures of a Tobago girl who was born and raised on this island all right so if you are new consider subscribing to my youtube channel all right it is free and you are welcomed if it's if you are a returning subscriber welcome back welcome back to this youtube channel you know that you are appreciated across here and today we have another amazing vlog i it is a public holiday here in tobago public holiday so it means all banks are closed most businesses are closed but a friend asked me to come out to supervise her teenage daughter who is going to cinema with some friends so i just decided i'll come along just to help supervise them and i'm here you know i would like you to come along for today's journey as we as you would be exposed to what it is like to visit a cinema the only cinema on the island of tobago it's called movie town and movie town is a cinema company that has several branches throughout the two islands of this country all right so tobago has one cinema and i remember years ago in tobago there was there was always one cinema but the cinema in tobago was called rex rex cinema and that cinema was located in scarborough which is right where kfc is in scarborough so kfc is where rex cinema used to be all right so what is the name of what is the name of the so what is the name of the cinema in your city all right i want you to tell me in the comment section all right the name of our cinema here in tobago is movie town and i will take you along to see what that cinema is like so i'm at the lowlands mall lowlands mall right it's a holiday and as i show earlier look at the car park it's literally empty right but today we are in for a treat all right so and the mall is closed there <laughs> so we're going i want to show you all lovely cinema it's called movie town and it's so vibrant in colors yes movie town I'll take you all inside you will get to meet those teenage girls and guys if their parents have given permission for them to be filmed right so this is movie time <laughs> very quiet wednesday and we're going to see some of the movies let's go and see what movies they have showing let's go and see So we're going to see 
coming soon to the cinemas Ghostbusters Frozen Empire hmm. and then we have Kung Fu Panda now showing so it's between Godzilla Kong Ghostbusters and Kung Fu Panda hmm. This is the box office. I ain't ready for the box office yet. I'm waiting to see when those girls come. So we have the fall. <laughs> oh gosh, the fall coming soon. <laughs> We have coming soon to the cinema, Abigail. Hmm. She's so pretty. Is that blood on her clothes? Hmm. But it says children can be so can be such monsters hmm that's an interesting story and now showing Godzilla the new empire hmm. I never look at Godzilla I ain't look at King Kong hmm. and I don't know nothing about these two movies but I'm here so this one I think King Kong was a, was a big monkey, a big ape. <laughs> so this is King Kong. I remember there was a King Kong toy. And this one is Godzilla. So, this is what's happening. So let me go in and see if they're open. Or if the food court is open. Oh, they're still closed. Oh. So, welcome back to your truly DKC. It's me yet again. I'm filming from Movie Town today where I'm going to be showing you a vlog about my experience visiting the cinema to look at a movie. Alright? However, my mind is on a question that was asked in my comment section by one of my subscribers. One of the questions was, is Tobago safe? And another question that was asked was is Tobago suitable for persons who wants to come home retire and settle down you know so I want to address those two questions in my opinion the world is not safe all right and because the world is not safe and Tobago is a part of the world then Tobago is not safe it is not 100% safe but very often those questions like these are addressed from a comparative standpoint all right so is it relatively safe all right I would say yes it is relatively safe all right now when someone asks if a country is, re is safe or relatively safe they would speak about 
am I safe when walking about in the streets? Am I safe if I'm alone? Am I safe to be adventurous and discover? Am I safe in my home? Is robbery and crime an issue? Are homicides and murders popular? And how popular is it? You know? So Tobago has been experiencing an, an increase in the amount of crime and violence and we have had reports of of violence being extended towards those who have visited and uh, I am not here to make an excuse for Tobago I am not here to justify or to say for example people would say people who commit any crime not from Tobago they come from Trinidad I don't have the facts on that so I'm not speaking about that right but Tobago has experienced crime and violence and robberies right but if you were to compare it with other countries we can say that yes Tobago is safe Tobago can be enjoyed all right whether you are in a group or riding by yourself all right however caution is always important all right so is Tobago safe yes it is it is relatively safe and you can come to Tobago and enjoy and if you were to ask a hundred persons is Tobago safe I could safely safely say that 90 out of a hundred or more would say yes it is you know so you can come to Tobago it's clean it's clean safe and serene and our security systems here work towards ensuring safety on the island all right and therefore you can experience safety and security while being here now Tobago people are friendly and we look out for others so when you are here even if you are by yourself you would experience meeting people who would love you and look after you all right we are hospitable and very often we would invite persons to our home where you can feel safe however as with anywhere in the world there is a need for caution there's a need for common sense you know no matter where you go you have to exercise caution you are responsible for yourself primarily are you you are responsible for the decisions you make are you and therefore you will not venture into a place that you don't feel comfortable so is Tobago safe the answer is a resounding yes Tobago is relatively safe now what about whether Tobago is good for persons who are desirous of moving to this island and retiring what is needed what do people need what do people need when they when they are retiring in the in the old age for want of a better word they need safety they need security they need services they need health care um good health care right my bag yeah <laughs> right good health care right and therefore and therefore The, the record has shown that many persons who were born in Tobago have chosen to return home upon retirement. No matter whether they were living in the US, they were living in England, they were living in Germany, many persons return home. Now that could be because as they say a neighbor Stringberry here, but for someone who is not from Tobago for example, can you choose Tobago and enjoy your retirement in Tobago? 
the answer is yes Tobago is a beautiful place it is slow paced it's calm and relaxed a lot of scenic sites for relaxation a lot of beaches that you can go and retire during the day there are many activities for that are safe that can be enjoyed by the elderly many of our beaches are, are very I would say disabled friendly disabled friendly in the sense of access to the water some beaches you can park so close to the water and it's a very short walk most beaches have lifeguards all right and lifeguards who are willing to provide assistance and remember i told you tobago people love to help so you will always find someone who is willing to help all right you know um healthcare in trinidad and tobago healthcare is free and therefore you can benefit from free public health care services all right from accident and emergency um hospital visits to clinic visits and health center to deal with more minor issue bruises elderly persons because of health concerns like diabetes and high blood pressure you can go and get tested you can go and get support you can get good health care for diabetic injuries all right so can you retire here yes the air the air is sweet the air is fresh all right and who don't want to breathe fresh air every day eh? who, don't, who don't want to enjoy this breeze every day you know and who don't want to enjoy the warmth of the sun every day come on you know so yes you can retire and settle in tobago and let this be your home that you can retire and enjoy when you are older all right so that's how i would address those two questions and i want to thank you for you know for listening to me tell me what you think tell me whether you are in agreement with what i said and what are your thoughts about what i said you know so <laughs> i come in so i want to thank you so much for come on come on come and say hi to the vlog hi <laughs> yeah let me say hi i come in it's only because i see a son in your whatsapp that i recognize it was him <laughs> yes right All right, honey, I respect. It's always good to let, let me know. I appreciate I can cut it out. <laughs> it's if I don't say nothing, I don't. To me, asking people, you just get no, 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 you know? So I just, just do it and I put, say no, I just I cut it out. So you know it's love and respect. All right, thank you, lovey. So are you ready to go Yeah, I'll check you. <laughs> so what you having? Popcorn, okay. All right. But you also have from a, from a natural for the ones. When last year come to the cinema, long time. Oh, no, they ain't give me no straw. You could bring a straw for my darling. Oh, I don't understand why they ain't give me. I buy natural, look at them. 
Ja, lecker zu Hause. 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 Ja, If you want to come across, I'm going to put the door once again on the camera, so I'll shift to the camera to turn my hair, right? Coming back to play air hockey. So we have air hockey. Look at this one. Pac Man. <laughs> and let me show on the other side. I have some boring girls. <laughs> Look. And we have the arcade. <laughs> All right, so let's do this.
That's for length. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. To take out mine from my arm. I want to introduce all, three, all of you all. Come, so one by one. Yeah? So, first of all, um, this. But one, one here, here. You can leave it just so. So we're not going and look at the movie. Because all that's a pass through me to go in there. <laughs> You're wicked. I'm wicked. <laughs> Alright. Come, come, come on, let's finish up to ask you a question. <laughs> All right. Welcome back to your truly DKC. I'm here with a group of young people. And look at where we are. We are at the cinemas today. And we came to look at what movie? Um, Godzilla X Kong. Godzilla X Kong. New Empire. So, have you seen the trailer for this movie? Yeah. And what do you think about it? Good. It's good? Mm -hmm. <laughs> what do you see? You don't have to feel pressure. Anybody want to be in it? Well, the young people just young in it. We have basketball. Ping pong. What do you call this game again? A hockey. Air hockey. Air hockey. So I'm coming back to play air hockey. So we have air hockey. Look at this one. Pac Man. <laughs> and let me show you this side. I have some boring girls. <laughs> Look. And we have the arcade. <laughs> All right, so let's do this. Just filming. Right. So I need to take out mine from my arm, my pulse. Nobody to film me. <laughs> okay. Thank you so much. 
Okay. Oh god. So I took excuse me, I took keep this piece of chit. Yeah. I took keep the chit. Yeah, the thing is. It falls from my hand, so I don't know if you could help me. Thank you so much, Rob. Welcome. Okay. Yeah. Wow. Look at that. Look at that. <laughs> Let's lead to the movies. <laughs> Look at this. Oh. Legend says a pan human lived side by side. Impossible as that may seem. Why do they hunt her? She is smarter than most. The elders. Do not tell us everything about this world. Apes hunt humans. That is wrong.
come, 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 come. The two kids in the corner, the, the teenager and the girl in the corner, they need help to know where to put the card. I can't help. Oh, sorry, hon. Ah, so cute. <laughs>
didn't understand the game so much. All right, I understand. I totally understand. She could, she would like this one, huh? basketball and try to shoot some hoops no oh everything <laughs> oh gosh a week <laughs> always on my mind always on my mind always on my mind and this young girl telling them I'm carrying them to the skating ring to see if they would be excited. It was a sure failure. Are we going to the skating rink now? I'm telling you. So if this is the energy, then we're really not going to the skating rink. So we're going to the skating rink? Listen. So there is a positive I see in their reaction. They know they did not leave home with their parents' permission to go to any skating rink. So the fact that they were confused, as it were, in my opinion, or just not very excited was strange for me because I expected them to be like, we go into the skating rink. But that was not the reaction. <laughs> but of course, I see a positive in their reaction and... You know, I hope that one of these days that we will do, we will get to go to the skate ring. I don't know if they will want me on that one, but I go right back. Let's see how it goes. So I call the parents. The parents come in for them, but the parents told me I can leave them. They will be there in about 15 minutes. So I left them, said goodbye, and I'm making my way home. Of course, I'm traveling because I don't have my car. Right, so I'll have it back soon. Bye, so, mom. This was Bye, just cinema. my thing to get back home, and it was <laughs> so easy. You wouldn't believe I got a ride to yes. come down. So from all country. roads lead to Goodwood. I did not have I to pay a cent. I am going to take a car and from the got mall in Lowlands to Scarborough, and from Scarborough I'll take a car to Goodwood. To Scarborough. All right, so I'll see you in my next amazing video. <laughs> and then I got a ride free straight to Goodwood. <laughs>